Hey what's up, I'm Tom Court and I'm here to explain to you some of the details on the new 2012 North Vegas. For 2012, the new North Vegas has several different settings. It's got the new school and wake style setting and the freestyle setting. These settings are all adjusted on the tips of the kite using the front and the rear pigtails. So this is the tip on the new 2012 Vegas. And as you can see here, there are two different modes. There's the freestyle mode and the new school and wake style mode. These are governed by two different knots on the attachment point at the front of each tip. The first attachment point is the freestyle mode. This allows the kite to steer very quickly and to also have a lot of D-power when you need it. So it makes it a much more all-round sea kite feeling. When you buy a new North Vegas, it will come on the freestyle setting. I prefer the freestyle setting in rough, gusty conditions because it gives me a lot more control over my kite and a lot more D-power. This enables the kite to steer faster and have more D-power whilst you're riding. It's perfect if you just want to go out and boost some big jumps or hit some waves. The wake style and new school mode is set slightly back on the tip. This reduces the steering very slightly but also reduces the D-power of the kite. But what this will do whilst you're riding is give it a much more heavy feel on the bar and give a lot more power through your tricks. I use the wake style and new school setting when I'm at a really good spot. This enables me to get better pop out of the kite and slower steering which is better through more complex tricks. Between the new school and the freestyle modes you have to take the length of string that is attached by the two loops at the front on the front setting. It will be it will come like this when you order your kite. Take that off and then reattach it to the wake style and new school setting. So, the freestyle and new school settings at the front of the kite help adjust the D-power, but the settings on the back of the kite will also help to adjust the steering. When your kite comes, it will come with the fast steering option at the very back of the kite tip. The inner knot on the back of the kite will help to slow the kite down and really delay the steering reaction. This will give you more control when unhooking and also help through more complex tricks. The back tip adjustment can be used in conjunction with any of the front settings on your kite. So you can have a fast kite that steers fast with a lot of D-power and also a kite that steers slowly with not so much D-power, ideally for freestyle. Overall, these new tip adjustments on the new 2012 North Vegas have helped to make this kite suitable for almost every style of rider and totally customizable.